Here comes Miller again. He does just pick up Quattararo to lead. How vital could that be? Jack Miller exactly where he wanted to be. It looks like Miguel Oliveira got away exceptionally well as well too. He did from fourth place on the grid. The Portuguese man fires himself up into second place. That was a great move from Oliveira. Very brave indeed to go up into second place. Oliveira, he's not going to be close enough to attack Miller by his turn 10. Likewise, Quattararo won't be able to fling up the inside of the Portuguese man as well. A wide there from Miller. That allows Miguel Oliveira through. He's now side by side with Quattararo, but he's got the inside line into turn five just to hold on to P2. Yeah, Quattararo will hear that factory Suzuki behind. Five different manufacturers here inside the top five. Quattararo drops down to fifth. It's Oliveira that leads. It's KTM, Ducati, Suzuki, Aprilia, Ducati. As it stands, Fabio Quattararo biding his time on Miguel Oliveira. But he's going through yeah. on turn five. You can see leads. that that was coming all the way through turn three and four. He, he had the better edge grip than Oliveira. He was able to run the tighter line. Can Oliveira find a way to quickly retaliate? Oliveira is a little bit closer on this circuit than he was previously to Quattararo. And can he just pick up that slipstream? Quattararo will punch a big hole in the air for the KTM man here. Now then, Oliveira's got the slipstream. Can he get up the inside in the braking zone on Quattararo? He certainly can, and with that extra straight line stability of that hard front tyre, he made that look relatively easy. Great move from Miguel Oliveira. Fantastic stuff. This is a, more of a race than Fabio Quattararo was expecting. The checkered flag is out, and it looks like this one is Miguel Oliveira's. Joan Zarco simply isn't close enough. What a magic, marvellous performance this is. It will be close across the line, but Miguel Oliveira wins on the factory KTM here in Barcelona, ahead of Joan Zarco and Quattararo, but he will not finish third with a penalty. Miller moves up one spot. But take a bow, Miguel Oliveira. Unbelievable ride by Miguel Oliveira, absolutely sensational. Zarco takes second, Quattararo takes the chequered flag third, bare-chested as well, but he will not be on the podium. A three-second penalty coming the way of the Frenchman. He's lost crucial world championship points. Zarco, the bridesmaid again, 11 MotoGP podiums, his eighth runner-up spot, but Miguel Oliveira, absolutely brilliant in Barcelona. What a job he did. Survived a late onslaught from the Frenchman. You've got to take your hat off to this young man who said at the start of the year, I could be the world championship contender, but they had to wait their time. They had to wait their time to get that chassis. What a job. Fond memories, of course, for Miguel Oliveira here. His first ever Grand Prix podium was here nine years ago in Moto3. That was a phenomenal, awesome job by that young man, Miguel Oliveira, absolutely brilliant.